Welcome to Google Project.com. Let's see the process of uh, the action uh, inspired or meta shuttling of parallel application on global grids. So in this process, we're going to apply the meta shuttling to map the jobs between the two resources and as well as the part of uh, several jobs by including by the user. So the system centric approach so gives the less importance to the user and as the approach is the hardware to the system performance like uh, to create the grid sim. So to create a grid sim we have to create a number of resources as well as the number of uh, machines. So based upon the number of users. So the meta scheduling is used to scheduling the task is given by the ask and bid. So based on the ask uh, the jobs is allocated between the 15 percentage of the more user requirements so between the uh, load balance so utilization between their uh, jobs so the user is giving us a uh, hundred jobs so the, for the uh, every uh, jobs is greater the user is uh, resource id so based upon the resource so it will be allocated to the uh, that user so there will be a two process of the ask and bid so the ask is a constant value and as well as the bid is the different uh, cost is based upon that uh, jobs let's see the flow of the process so first we're going to start about the to create a uh, grid clients uh, by use of the grid simulation and as well as the client user so we're going to create the auction creation here so by use of auction creation we have a two process between the meta shore line so there is a resource queue and as well as the resource val valuation in resource queue means the number of uh, uh, jobs is going to waiting in the process between the first out and the first uh, first in first come process line. So then the resource valuation is based upon the bid. So if the both uh, allocation shoveling process is done, then the job will be validated between the, the user to based upon the resource. So in the action, uh, in the action creation, so the process will be bid. So it's based upon the jobs and. Uh, it will be shuttling and after that uh, shuttling finish the jobs uh, allocated to that the resource is based upon that uh, jobs of the initial value and as well as the time based of the initial time and the execution time so between the uh, process will be completed let's see the execution of the process uh, first and from the mode time <laughs> So this is the main frame of the home screen of the double action. So first to create the resource. I'm creating a resource as a tool. So now the resource is created. Then I'll uh, create the number of uh, resources as well as the number of uh, ratings and the number of issues and working. So after this we have to create the grid sim uh, simulation process. So now we give the enter enter the next uh, ratings for the resource one. I give it as a thousand and uh, maximum limit is the initial finish time is the four percent. So I create uh, two resources. So that's why uh, uh, going to create the two resources of the next uh, ratings and initial value. So after that the grid creation is completed and it's saved. So now go to the next process is the uh, to create the number of users to create a number of jobs. So I'm creating a hundred jobs and uh, click to uh, create a grid blood. So now the jobs is created as a start time and as well as the finishing time. So after the close for the first user then create a second user as the hundred jobs. So close. So now the every jobs and uh, every execution is giving us a user ID and as well as the job ID. So click next. So click new means. So this is the process for the every user's is the ID of uh, is in the waiting process of the start time as well as the finishing time. So user uh, for job one, job two as a user ID is up to the hundred. Up to the hundred jobs is the same ID for the user one. So after the 100 job over, it uh, goes to the second user as the user ID and the starting time and the finishing time. So this is the waiting process of the queue. So click next. So this is the user ID is the available start means. So click means available start of the initial value at the number of process allocation. 
and there are load and the waiting time so this is for the board for the resource id5 and as well as the resource for the server so click here so now the evaluation will be getting displayed so here the evaluation is taken from the ask and the build equation so here the ask value is getting from the number of uh, jobs and number of machines we have the uh, number of resources and the number of um, machines we have created means so you go into multiply by and uh, ask value will be generated and as well as the build will be generated by using creating a number of jobs so we are going to create a number of jobs so it will be created so after that we are going to shortlist them so here the shortlist is uh, in asset uh, sending order and this is the descending order of the process so after that the sending process is going to allocate a lot of so to this means so here the process is allocated the process of and five so some of the process in waiting few means it will show as the vending process so these are the vending process of the so small and system so this is the performance of the load so this is the capacity of the building and the sharing process of the usage and the job is allocated of the particular uh, bed and the uh, particular resource to be that user so this is the process of the development thank you